So as you will see, to activate the lift, you've got to use your card in the reader before you press the button. It's a good security feature. Uh, the lifts are fast, clean, modern, metallic. That's all I've got to say. Willkommen. Oh, welcome. There's some lights on. To the Intercity Hotel at Nuremberg Hauptbahnhof. Or right next door to Nuremberg Railway Station in the city centre of Nuremberg in Bavaria in Germany. I'm here for one night only and room only. This has cost €68.35 with booking.com you can uh, convert it into other currencies at your leisure so um, Intercity is a very it's a basic businessy brand hotel in Germany some of the newer ones are really nice some of the older ones are showing signs of wear and tear this one strikes me as being somewhere in between but um, it looks all right to be quite honest I'm gonna go through uh, what you get for your money so coming in through the front door just there you get a full length mirror for checking yourself out. Three coat hooks for hanging three coats or optional garments that are not coats. There's a light switch and a plug socket just there as you come in. And then there's a light switch and uh, ooh, yeah baby. So if you fancy developing any old uh, film here then that's the dark room. I'll come to that afterwards. So then on your left hand side just here there is ample wardrobe space with a built-in safe and a complimentary to use umbrella. Nice, that's a nice touch. There are one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten coat hangers all together and ample storage space. Oh, I shouldn't have done that because that's just annoying now isn't it? Sorry. Well, I'm just going to have to talk over it. Down here, next to the wardrobe, we have a minibar. And above that, we have a flat screen LG TV. There's another plug socket there that you can use. Next to that is my luggage. Lots of it. I'm working over here for a week. And uh, down here, is another plug socket and tea and coffee making facilities and even some hot chocolate powder. Up there is an expensive bottle of water uh, with some glasses next to it and underneath that is a, a nice sitting area. There's a little coffee table, uh, a more formal sitting chair and then there is a nice size double bed. It's just a double, it's not a king or anything like that, uh, but perfect for one person. Uh, maybe a squeeze for two, but uh, fine by me. And it's one of those beds that's got the wooden rim around the edge, so I'm gonna be bash. No doubt bashing myself on that like I always manage to. On either side of the bed is a plug socket and a light switch. And there's a telephone as well on that side. Okay, so I'll just spin that round. So it's May, it's about 22 degrees outside in Nuremberg today. It's really sticky. So let's open the window. It says there's aircon, and I'm sure there is, but I haven't played with it yet. Come on, that's it. We don't let window restrainers sold us back. And so this is a uh, Proximity to the Hauptbahnhof. There you go. There's the Hauptbahnhof. And here's some uh, caging to stop you uh, chucking yourself onto the tracks or to stop any pigeons coming into your rooms. But quite a big Hauptbahnhof, and I'm travelling from there tomorrow to Ilmenau in Thuringia. And there's an ICE train just coming through now, which is what I'll be on tomorrow. Nice ice baby. So, nice little uh, cityscape view anyway. 
across the tracks and of course when the windows closed the noise that you can hear out there diminishes and instead all you can hear is that annoying ticking it does finish eventually the lights went off now see right oh and you get a complimentary little sweetie that's nice so let's have a look in the bathroom which looks like a fairly modern uh, and refurbed bathroom I'd say definitely a refurbed bathroom we've got a nice shiny black sink standard motel one fire very good with tissues just there toilet just there uh, hair dryer for those people who want to preen their bouffants towel big mirror hello and there is the uh, shower no doubt a grower and you get a bottle of aqua splash to keep yourself clean that was a very small step up just there but nothing to worry about but the surface is not non-slip and that is in fact a slippery when wet surface so not my favorite type of surface for that kind of shower so Spin around, sorry about the curtain, I'll move it back eventually. But uh, it's not a bad room really, is it? It'll do me for one night. And I've never been to Nuremberg before. So I'm now going to go out, explore, see the sights. And I shall report back later. I'll oh, feed us in for now. Oh, there is the air conditioning. See ya. Incidentally, if you were wondering what the uh, red light is for, it's if you fancy making your own porno. Of course it's not, it's a heat lamp. It's one of those bulbs which gives off a bit of heat, that's it. Nothing insidious, insidious, whatever the word is. But you could develop photographs in there, definitely. And 30 years ago, I would have tried it. Right, I'm definitely going. Bye.